blackmail and secrecy. However, her plan went wrong, the reasons of which I will outline below. Hello? Hey, Monique, it's Cassandra. I'm supposed to be out. It's a party night. Yeah, I guess so. Well, look, I'm going to get you out of that house no matter what. This is a guy. A guy? Yeah. What guy? He's a friend. Trust me. You need to get your butt off the couch. Okay, well, I got to go. I have some important stuff to do. All right, peace. So what are we going to do about Monique? I don't know. I mean, it's like every time we set her up, it just never works. Why don't we try the groove, Father? <laughs> don't you think that's a little intense? Well, I mean, we've tried everything else. We've got do every guy I can think of, every guy you can think of. No, no. I mean, we couldn't have. And we know so many people. Let me, let me think. Let me think. Our list has diminished. There's no <laughs> one left. There has been a lot of people, but... No, no. Oh, I remember the guy. We went to the picnic, right? Okay. And remember the guy that was with that girl? That was with the other girl that had that little short thing on. We were saying what a hoe she was. The, the little. The, okay, I know yeah. who you're talking about. Yeah, but the guy. I mean, the guy. Uh, he had the little uh -huh. thing. And he, oh, yeah, yeah. Cute. See, yeah, he was. I think he was just her oh. type. You think she'll like him though? We don't have anybody else to try. <laughs> okay, we'll try it your way. Yeah, I mean, he seemed nice at the party and all. Okay, so we'll give your boy a try, but if it don't work, we go my way. <laughs> All right, I gotta find that number. <sighs> Hello, Cassandra. Hey, I wanna hear what happened to your. Hey, wait! Don't say anything. I'm gonna I'm gonna put Tanya on the other line. Okay? Okay, hold on. <sighs> Hello? Yeah, I'm here. Okay, everybody's there? Uh-huh. All right, now go ahead. Cassandra, what the hell was that? You set me up with a player. He was having sex when I called him. It wasn't that bad, was it? No, it was great. Uh, do you smell that? That's sarcasm. I think there's somebody that you need to see. His name is the Groove Father. The who? <laughs> the Groove Father. He hooked me and Cassandra both up. I, I've never heard of this guy. He sounds like some relic from the 70s, looking like a huggy bear. He's a little eccentric. Don't worry about what he looks like. Wait, hold on, I got another call. Okay, I'll wait. Hello? Hi, honey, it's me. Hey, Mom. What are you doing? Nothing. I just called to say hi. Hey, I'm talking to my friend. I'm going to call you back, okay? Okay, call me back. Okay, bye. Yeah, girl, so look, I was not sure about everything, and he just... Hello? Hello? Still here. Mom. <laughs> hey, I gotta call you back. What was that all about? No, it was just it was just a story or something for school. Okay, bye. Bye. Hello? Yeah, I'm here. Uh -huh. Oh my god. There you guys are. Anyway, the groove father is so good. Uh-huh. He hooked me and Tyrone up. That's it, okay. I'm gonna set you up with the groove father. Don't worry, I'll take care of everything. All right, hook it up. All right. All right. Okay, bye. Okay. Talk to you later. All right, peace. Bye. Mom.
you know what, Billy? I already know what your problem is. The real father knows all. First of all, you... Yeah, that's um, why I'm here. Uh, can I see what you're working with, girl? See what I'm working with? You can be mad. You ain't got to believe me now, but... True. Act like you above it, girl. That's what your problem is. Okay. Uh, you don't believe me, huh? You the group, father. It's all that about seeing you another time. You didn't help me with shit. <laughs> I gave you a solution, babe. Dang. Yes.